Last month, we had taken a look at the Composer agent from Abacus AI that can practically code out anything with its agentic AI capabilities similar to Cursor's Composer or Windsurf's Cascade, but this being cheaper and faster. It's built within their code editor called Code LLM, which is a part of Abacus AI suite of tools that also lets you access multiple products like Chat LLM that lets you chat with all of the state of the art models as well as their computer agent for the same price. Now recently, it's rolling out with a couple of new features like the introduction of a faster autocomplete that is blazing fast, you have the Claude 3.7 Sonnet being used now as their primary model with no rate limits. You also have agentic capabilities that have been upgraded, newer models, a UX design, and so much more. Now before we even get to all of that, for the people who do not know what CodeLM is, it's an AI code editor that helps you 10x your developer productivity and it's truly amazing because it can easily help you code out anything. To showcase the capability of Abacus AI's Composer agent, just take a look at this demo which fully codes out an app for you. This not only just builds the front end, but it also works on the back end for you, where it can fully develop any sort of front end web page linked to a back end, and it also helps you create intuitive designs that are functional and they have the ability for you to actually deploy it. So this is something that you're going to be able to see throughout today's video. Before we get started, I just want to mention that you should definitely go ahead and subscribe to the World of AI newsletter. I'm constantly posting different newsletters on a weekly basis, so this is where you can easily get up-to-date knowledge about what is happening in the AI space. So definitely go ahead and subscribe as this is completely for free. Now having the ability to use Claude 3.7 Sonnet without any sort of rate limit is just going to be insane because this is a model that shows strong improvements in coding as well as front-end web development so essentially you can use it to code out anything and this is such a powerful model that will assist you in practically every complex scenario when you're working and dealing with code there are a lot of other features like tab to auto complete your code you can have it so that you can route through different large language models to process your query you have Agent Composer, which is the new feature. You have the ability to ask AI to edit your code, whether that's debugging or asking for enhancements. You also have it so that it can edit code in place, where it can streamline edits, it can set checkpoints for any changes that have been made. And essentially, it is a great way for you to have AI work towards generating your code and efficiently use other suites of tools that Abacus AI provides, like ChatLM. The great thing is, is that you can easily get started for free where you can access a free month minimum for two month subscriptions. So, and it's pretty cheap in terms of how much they charge monthly. So go ahead, if you're interested in working with this, go ahead and click on get started and sign up and create an account with Abacus AI. Once you sign up or sign in, you want to then head over to code LM and then you want to install this based off of your operating system. Since I have it for windows, I'm going to go ahead and install this for my operating system. After installing, you can open it up and you're going to be then greeted with the main dashboard. On the right hand side, you have the composer agent that you can access. And then you also have a chat mode where you can ask it to debug your code or just simply using it to explain certain things about your code, which is where you can get responses out of it quite quickly. And it can assist you in analysis as well as explaining certain types of difficult, complex scenarios. Now, this is just an example, but here is a repository and I can simply go over and choose any of these models from Sonnet 3.7 all the way to 01 mini. So you get a lot of flexibility in in terms of what model you want to use in my opinion you would want to use the sonic 3.7 but you can also use the thinking model which is going to allow you to get a more thoughtful answer we can send over this prompt to go over to my project and find any errors if there is any and then have it fix it now what you can also do is you can paste in the at function which will allow you to tag any sort of file so you can even have it so that you can tag multiple files and then you can have the ai analyze those files for you so we can go over and send in this prompt it will then analyze those three files that we had attached and then it's going to be able to find any bugs if there is any and fix it for you 
So it looks like it has provided a couple of suggestions and say if I want to insert it into the exact file, we can click on insert and then you can go over and click apply and you will see the diff change that has been made and then you can accept it if it is correct or if you want to go forward with the change that was suggested. And overall, with the Composer agent, you're going to get more contextual awareness with its agentic capabilities to make changes across your overall code base, which is going to save you so much more time than going ahead and manually changing everything, which is why you can use the agent mode for this and then having it powered by the Claude 3.7 Sonnet, which will essentially automate the whole process. Next up, we're going to go over to the agent mode and showcase the capability of the new agentic features where it is faster in terms of its generation and it has been able to generate better structured outputs with this new Claude 3.7 Sonnet model. And this is essentially where I'm going to have it create a modern intricate finance app for tracking expenses, income and overall financial health. And we're going to have it fully generate this application for us. So you can see it's going to check what current workspace you're in and then it's going to go ahead and create all the components necessary, which you can see live in action. So this is something that we'll then take a look at once that's fully generated. All right, so it looks like it is ready to use. I just needed to simply install and then start the server up. And this is what we've gotten. This is actually truly remarkable because we have a functional sign in and sign up page. We're going to go over and paste in an email. And now we're going to go over and sign in. And once you have signed up or signed in, you're going to be then greeted with the main dashboard. And it does look pretty intuitive. And this is actually really, really nice. This is the best generation I've gotten for any sort of finance app that i've created on this channel where you have multiple pages the ability to track all your transactions with different types of income as well as expenses you also have the ability to track your budget you can add a budget so you can see everything is actually pretty functional and you have the ability to add multiple different types of categories of budgets and then the amount that you want to put in you have insights on what you should be doing shopping budget almost depleted and this will give you insights on smart recommendations of your finances which is really nice it also tracks your spending categories and then lastly you have the settings page where you have the ability to manage your preference profile settings obviously none of this is functional but you can see that thanks to the composer agent it was able to build out a fully functional structure of your app that you can then work on even more you can change the color scheme you can add different fonts and then you can add different sorts of instructions to improve certain intuitive designs for this but this is just a great way for you to easily get started and generate the base structure of your code which would save you hours this is something that generated almost everything that is functional for any sort of finance app with the dashboard, your transactions, your budget, as well as your insights, and then even a settings page. It even had a login structure set up for you. And this would potentially take many people a couple of days to even set up. But in this case, it was able to generate the base structure of everything within just about four minutes, which is just insane. And this is why I definitely recommend that you try this out with the Claude 3.7 Sonnet as you have unlimited usage with it. And on top of that, you get to access ChatLM where you have a all-in-one AI platform where you can access state-of-the-art large language models for you to work with. And you can also use their computer agent as well as their AI engineer and even create different sorts of AI agents within this platform. But that's basically it for the new update of the Composer Agent. It is definitely something that you should take a look at with all the links that I use in today's video in the description below. Make sure you take a look at Abacus AI's Code LM. Uh, I'll also leave a link to Chat LM so that you can easily take a look at the features for it. I actually have a couple of videos on it, so definitely recommend you watch that. If you like this video and would love to support the channel, you can consider donating to my channel through the super thanks option below. Or you can consider joining our private discord where you can access multiple subscriptions to different AI tools for free on a monthly basis. Plus daily AI news and exclusive content plus a lot more. 
subscribe to the newsletter follow me on the patreon make sure you follow me on twitter and lastly make sure you guys take a look at the youtube channel because there's a lot of videos that you will truly benefit from make sure you turn on the notification bell so that you can see up to date with whatever is happening in the world of ai but with that thought guys thank you guys so much for watching have an amazing day spread positivity and i'll see you guys fairly shortly peace out fellas